In this video, I'll show you a quick, simple, and effective way to disable your coupons in your WooCommerce checkout in just a few simple steps. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. Okay, so the first step is to head over to WeSuite.com. Go ahead and download the all-in-one checkout plugin. The free version should be fine. Once you've done so, let's head back over to our dashboard. So I'll leave the link in the description below for the all-in-one checkout plugin by WeSuite. Okay, so let's navigate to our checkout page. So I've already installed and set up um, the all-in-one checkout plugin. So I'll show you how to go ahead and actually disable this coupon section here as well. And if you wanted to use a template similar to this one, you can also do so as well. So here customers can enter in their coupon code, apply. So I'll show you how to disable this coupon section completely. And if you didn't want to use this custom um, template that's fine also you'll still be able to disable the coupon section okay so let's navigate back to our dashboard okay so here we are on our wordpress dashboard so i'm assuming you've already uploaded and installed a plugin so you just go plugins um, and new upload and install the plugin if you're already a WeSuite customer then the all-in-one checkout plugin menu will be under WeSuite, and then you'll see aio checkout here if not then it will have its own separate menu and you can just go ahead and click on all-in-one um, checkout Okay, so now the next step would be to actually create a checkout form. So we just go ahead and click create new checkout here. And then once you've done so, so since I've already created one, I'm just gonna go ahead and edit this one. Okay, so to disable our coupon um, section, we'll just navigate down to where it says um, order form summary. We'll click on this settings icon. And then here we'll just go ahead and select hide um, coupon section. Okay, so whilst we're here, if you wanted to disable any other fields, you can go ahead and click this eye icon to hide it, or you can rearrange the fields as well. So you can just drag and drop it to wherever you like. And if you wanted to add additional fields, you can just click on this settings icon here and just go ahead and drag the field onto the page. Similarly, you can create um, additional steps as well, just by creating this plus um, icon. Okay, so now we'll move on to the design section. So again, currently I'm using our um, two column layout. Okay, but if you wanted to try this with your theme default styling, you can go ahead and select no template here. Okay, and then the third and last step is just to go ahead and enable this checkout form. So you just toggle this option to on, save changes, and then the changes should, well, let's go ahead and change, save it. And then the changes should reflect on the front end. So let's refresh this checkout page again, and hopefully all this section here should be hidden. Okay, so we no longer have a coupon section. So we've changed the checkout styling to use the default themes um, checkout design. So, okay, so this is my themes um, checkout styling. Okay, personally, I prefer our checkout styling. So I'll enable our checkout design again. And if we wanted, we can choose the um, single column layout as well. So let's just save changes. Okay, let's refresh this page. And again, our coupon section's hidden. Okay, so this is our order bump and we are upselling this particular product here. And then if you scroll down here as well, you can see another upsell, but in this case, we are actually trying to upsell customers into taking out a shipping insurance. Okay, so if you wanted to create a similar um, upsell on your site, I'll leave a link to the particular video in the description below. And that's how you disable the coupon section in your WooCommerce checkout in just a few simple steps. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more videos like this. And if you've got any questions, leave in the comment box below or reach out to support and we'll get back to you as soon as possible.